Okay, so it's more or less Tuesday. More or less, well, it is Tuesday. How could it be more or less of something? And I realize I haven't got my lav mic plugged in. But let's just check my brilliant idea of using nature's cool box. <sighs> ah, so it didn't snow, it just rained. Well, there's a little bit of ice on here, but one thing I had not considered is how to dry it off. But that's a bit of a success, is that? Now let's go and check. Oh, hang on. Morning, mate. How are we doing? My Robin friend is here, looking at me as if to say, why is that here? Now, the idea was, it was supposed to be freezing cold last night and these would have refrozen and have they yes they have oh brilliant okay means i can keep my feet cool oh, i should get down from the top of my van because somebody over there is looking at me going what the hell are you doing oh, it's tuesday night let's try and cook and tonight we're going to have these Really handy, and all they are are little papers that you open up, put the chicken into, and then cook. Uh, it's literally, you don't need to add any uh, fat, anything like that, 12 minutes, happy days. And I have here uh, salmon and vegetables, but I'm going to pick out the vegetables and I'm just going to snack on the salmon tomorrow. So, not sure if this is going to be enough food actually, if I'm honest, but. Let's crack on with it, shall we? So the idea is, you've probably seen these all before. Ah, bugger, I've pulled two out. Never mind. You quite literally do that. And yes, I will be washing my hands and everything like that because I'm handling raw poultry. You get a big old chicken breast, like this. Slap it in there. Fold it over. Pat it down. Engage the heater, or cooker. Turn on the cooker. Wait for the frying pan to heat up. And then it says cook it on a low heat. And so with no oil or anything like that. So let's pop that in for 12 minutes. Does it say put a lid on it to help? No, but I can save a bit of gas because I'm on my last bottle. So let's just turn that down a wee bit. Smack on the lid. So yeah, uh, let's let that cook for 12 minutes and see what we've got. I wish I had the head for a bandana or a buff. I just, I just really don't. I suppose it doesn't help either that I've just put on shed loads of weight. Uh, I was planning to go for a walk um, tonight, but it's tipping it down with rain and it's drizzly. So the excitement's going to come with a trip to Sainsbury's later on to get some water. Yeah. That is literally what I sometimes look forward to in the evening, is going to the big Sainsbury's, followed by a trip to the big Tesco. But what I might do this week is go to the big roundabout, the big Asda, which is on the big roundabout. It'll all make sense if I record any B footage. Right, let's wait for my food to cook. And yes, before anyone writes anything down below, I know I look completely ridiculous. But I'm trying. And then I need to wear it. Oh God, that's even worse. Oh God, ah! Okay, so it's six minutes later, and I did put a little bit of water in there. I have got a door open to ventilate, and I haven't got a, a, a not a fatura, what is it called? Uh, what's this? Spoon. So we'll use that to flip it over. Ah, hot. Even though I end up using most of my fingers, and... Oh, God, how do I even get this wrong? Ah! Right, let's try again. All you gotta do is turn. Ah! Hang on. Ah! Right. That'll do. 
Uh, I think, um, now, is a spatula classed as an essential item in Sainsbury's? Let's find out, let's get this back on. We set the timer, and you know what, I'm gonna warm up my veggies at the same time as well. There we go, I've just added some veggies in, just some, oh, but steamed, I can't what it's called now. I've done a nine and a half hour day, and so my mind is completely there. But let's steam that off. We've got six minutes to go. And uh, yeah, let's see what we end up with, shall we? Right, that is the full 12 minutes. Let us have a look at tonight's feast. Let's turn the heating off. I've got the window open, don't worry. And I've got my CO2 meter doing its thing. Ah, you bastard! Note to self, do not place finger over steam hole. Ah, oh, you bugger that hurt! Oh, flipping heck. So, I'm not too worried about the veg, but let's have a look at the Piazza de Resistance. Oh, hey up. That's looking quite nice. We will just put that over hither. I found a knife. So let's just check this is cooked. Uh, poke it in the middle, in it? Something like that. Yeah, looks relatively clear to me. Get it inside. Let's just do another double. Yes, yeah, there we are. That's a bit of a fat. Does that look? I shall give it another few minutes, methinks. Okay, so I shouldn't have put the water in because this should, it should be more like this than it is here. But the unintended consequence is I do have a nice little bit of gravy -ish stuff. There is one slight thing that I have forgotten. Let me just push that back. That is the size of my plate. Yes. I wonder if Sainsbury's... Oh, that really hurts, by the way. I really have burnt my finger. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not. Anyway, let's move on from that. Let's plate up. So it's kind of steamed chicken with vegetables, which should um, be quite nice. I would add some cheese to this, but I left the cheese in the office. Did I put it in the fridge? I hope so. So yes, anyway, uh, in this incredibly enthralling camera shot, we have a bit of chicken, um, some broccoli, and this stuff here that I can't remember what it is. I shall dump that into the B-roll after I've eaten my food. So let's do a taste test, shall we? <laughs> it's chicken, maybe a little bit overdone somehow. Is that red there? No. No, we're all good. A little bit overdone um, but yeah there we are tonight's food healthy so it pre cut I don't mind doing the chicken in here um, so yeah rock and roll Tuesday nights everybody I really should get a gamepad like a ps4 controller and do some standier stuff on my iPad well it's a must eat my food Bye-bye.